boy. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Glad you're here. Glad you're stopping by. I come here with bad news. Terrible news. Awful, awful, awful news. I'm going to cry. Uh, no, I'm not going to cry. I, I've seen this coming. It was going to happen. Uh, by the way, look at my bad hair. Just just look at it. Yeah, that's 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 beanie hair, by the way. That's, that's what happens when you take your beanie off, finally. It looks like I haven't washed my hair in like five weeks, but... Here I am. Here I am making a video with bad hair. Bad news. Bad hair. Just kind of made sense. Kind of made sense. Uh, it's not a chilly video, which I hope you guys are okay with that. Uh, not a chilly video. But it is a video, nevertheless. It is a video that I kind of felt like needed to be made. Uh, especially if you're a gamer. If you're a gamer, this is... I don't, I don't know. This is like a... This is bad. This is like almost like the equivalent end of Old Yeller when the kid goes out. It's like, oh, Yellers, he's got rabies. What should we do? I don't know. Put him down. That's what you're supposed to do. Old Yeller's got rabies now. But we're not here to talk about Old Yeller either. But this is like the equivalent of uh, just going out there, put it, take it to the shed, and just put it out of its misery. That's what we're kind of dealing with. And what am I talking about? What am I talking about? I'm talking about the death of E3. Now, I covered this a little bit maybe a year or so ago. I was talking about how E3 wasn't happening. Uh, again, bad hair, bad news. Um, we'll, we'll do this a lot. <laughs> we'll make this a occurring uh, segment. Bad hair, bad news. But anyways, anyways, E3 is over. It's officially done. Uh, it's... Basically, the people that's making E3 happen is dragging E3's corpse and saying, hey, we, we still exist. Today, I believe it was today or yesterday one, uh, I'd seen the news today. Um, Stony, Microsoft, and Nintendo are not going to be a part of it. And this is sad. This is sad because, um, you know, for years, we waited for these giant press conferences where Sony, Xbox, uh, well, Microsoft, and Nintendo would announce their new games, and slowly things started dying. You started having Nintendo Directs um, kind of bypassing E3, but they were still uh, E3 in some capacity. Uh, Sony, they started doing their state of play uh, recently, uh, and Microsoft, they just did their own Direct just the other day. Um but they kind of bowed out of this expo, which is a huge thing. It was a big gathering. Uh, all the big big players in the gaming industry would show up, show off their new games, talk about their DLC and their microtransactions, uh, or lack thereof, but only to throw it into the game after the launch. Um, it's, it sucks. It does suck. It's kind of sad because, like I said, I look forward to these things. I watch it every year on the now dead. Well... Double Dead G4. Um, sorry, rest in peace, G4. May the wokeness be with you. Um, yeah. <laughs> sorry, Frosk. Sorry, Frosk. It, Adam Cecil, you, it didn't work for you. It didn't work out this time. I know this is coming from a neck beard with bad hair, uh, reporting bad news, but E3 is now dead. It's dead. Uh, may we uh, wish E3... Good luck. Good luck. I, I, I'm actually excited about this. Uh, one, it's still happening, apparently. Uh, I would like to see what it's going to do without the big players. Uh, maybe Ubisoft, EA, and other big companies show up. Well, which, I mean, most of these companies are going to be bought out by Microsoft in the near future, probably. Um, <coughs> just more, more games from Microsoft's consoles. Um, yeah, I mean it's it, it kind of, it's kind of sad. It's it, but it's kind of exciting to see what happens next uh, with all the big key players. I mean, it's going to be nice to see more regular updates. I think this is going to happen more regular updates with these uh, publishers um, and the big companies, like seeing the more of the, the directs. Uh, I think that's going to be a big thing here in the future going on. Um, you know, I like to see more games news coming out instead of waiting for the equivalent of video game nerd Super Bowl, uh, which now it's taken place by, what is it, the VGAs? 
uh, Jeff Keeley Sting. Um, but yeah, I mean, it sucks. It does suck. It does suck. It does suck. Uh, they hear that one of my favorite things from back in the day is dead. Um, in in most capacities, let's just say it's dead. It's dead. It's it's, it's unrepairable at this point. Uh, but it is exciting to see where the industry goes ne next without these big expos. I mean, what's to say that Gamescon dis disappears or uh, Tokyo Game Show, uh, CES in some capacity, um, maybe it's the end of these things. Maybe it's going to be a digital future like uh, we knew was going to happen. Um, less money being spent on these massive stage shows and uh, exhibits and stuff like that, and now it's just going to be all digital. Uh, and it's easy, easier to create a one-hour show presentation than it is to bring all these people together, build these stages, and uh, all this other stuff. I, I think this is probably good. I think this is a good thing for the industry to kind of move past these big things. Um, yeah, like I said, it's kind of sad, too, because... Obviously, that's a part of the industry that's gone. And we'll go ahead and end it at that. Um, if you watch E3 back in the day, let me know what you think about it. Uh, we, and let me know if you want to do more of these uh, bad news, bad, <laughs> bad hair, bad news updates from here on out. That'd be kind of cool. Take off the beanie. The, the beanie's only going to be on until at least the, the spring. I mean, then then it's gone. Then it's gone. Then you'll have my regular hair and my continually growing beard, which I, I can't cut. I can't cut. It's going to continue to grow. I cannot cut the beard. Um, can't do it. Can't do it. I'm sorry. I know there's some people who's going to be disappointed in that, but the beard has to continue to grow. Has to continue. Has to continue. Uh, just like Chili says, we don't stop. We don't stop growing the beard. It doesn't happen. Uh, but I love you guys very much, and I'll see you soon. There's a girl called Chili, and the boys all love her, so they love her so. They love her so, ladies, my boys.